So with the last sky cam shot, I took you a little further north to Hernando and now we're a little further south in Vicksburg. This is I-20 West, I believe. So just a nice sunny start to the day. Some clouds starting to build in, but overall still looking pretty nice outside. And again, that's just what we're going to be dealing with as well in the Delta, some increasing cloud cover. So while we'll still have some sunshine staying with us for this morning and stretching to the early afternoon, we're just going to see some more clouds building in. But today will be warmer and we'll have some breezy conditions. So looking at the satellite and radar graphic, this is what has occurred for the last few hours, just clear skies. But within the last hour, hour and a half, we've had some clouds starting to move in. They're still mainly to the south and southwest of us over northern Louisiana, but again, starting to build near Vicksburg, just like what you saw in the sky cam and also heading eastward into Jackson. Now looking at the current temperatures, we're at 35 here in Greenville, 43 in Monticello, 32 in Batesville, 35 in Jackson and 36 down in Vicksburg. But the high for today will pretty much be right at about 60 all around the Delta. It's going to be feeling pretty nice for today. Yesterday felt nice as well, but again, just better than it was for the latter half of last week when we were barely getting above freezing for our daytime highs. And winds will be from the south southwest around 10 to 15 miles per hour, but gusting up to 20 miles per hour at times. And then the overnight low for tonight will be near 40. It'll be mostly cloudy. We could have some showers later on this evening and overnight. Greenville could get some of those showers, but it looks like it will mainly be to the south of us as the next cold front will be moving into our area. Winds will be from the south southwest around 10 to 15 miles per hour, and then they'll become northerly overnight and those wind gusts could get up to 20 miles per hour. And then for tomorrow, it's going to be mostly sunny, more on the windy side. Our highs will be in the upper 40s, a little bit cooler for tomorrow than it is for today. Winds will be from the north around 15 to 25 miles per hour, but gusts could get up to 30 at times. So looking at the river forecast, the Mississippi River is at 36 feet this morning, and it's going to go down for the next few days. And by the time we get to the weekend, it should be right at about 31 feet. So now looking at your future tracker, drier conditions starting off our day. It's going to get breezy a little bit later on. Winds are from the south southwesterly direction. And then as that front starts to get closer to our area, you can see we could have some showers over us here in Greenville. But again, it looks like it mostly stay more so in central and southern Mississippi. And that's for later on this evening and the overnight hours. And then behind the front, just going to be mostly dry once again and cooler as we'll have winds blowing in from the northerly direction. And then they'll be blowing in from the northeasterly direction by the time we get to Wednesday. So taking a look at your seven day forecast, a pretty mild week overall. We're going to have a couple of nights where we get to below freezing once again, but our daytime highs are pretty much going to remain in the upper 40s range with the exception of today, Sunday and Wednesday, but mostly dry conditions with the exception of later tonight and overnight with some showers moving in mainly to the south of us with that cold front. And then again, by the time we get to Sunday, we'll be in the upper 50s once again. So just enjoy your Monday and enjoy the nice milder weather. Thanks for tuning in.